Once upon a time, in a forgotten corner of the world, there stood a grand manor of sinister repute. The village folk whispered tales of its dark past, but none dared to venture too near. As the shadows grew longer and the wind wailed through the trees, the townspeople would lock their doors, fearing the evil that lurked within the walls of the malevolent manor. The manor's master, Lord Grimwood, had made a pact with a powerful demon. In exchange for eternal life, he had agreed to provide the demon with an innocent soul every year on All Hallows' Eve. In the dead of night, a villager would vanish, never to be seen again. The villagers lived in terror, as the curse seemed unbreakable. One fateful day, a young orphan named Eliza arrived in the village. With the innocence of a child and the wisdom of an elder, she sensed the darkness that enveloped the land. As All Hallows' Eve approached, Eliza devised a plan to rid the village of the terrible curse. On the eve of the darkest night, Eliza entered the manor under the guise of a lost traveler seeking shelter. Lord Grimwood welcomed her, his sinister eyes gleaming with anticipation. Unbeknownst to him, Eliza had a small vial of enchanted water hidden in her garments. As the clock struck midnight the demon appeared, demanding its yearly tribute. Eliza stepped forward, her heart pounding, and as she did, she threw the vial of enchanted water onto the demon. The demon screeched in agony as the holy water burned its vile flesh. As the demon writhed in pain, Lord Grimwood, consumed by fear and rage, lunged at Eliza. In an instant the brave girl sidestepped, causing the malevolent lord to plunge headlong into the demon's seething form. A blinding flash of light filled the room as the demon and the evil lord were consumed in a whirlwind of fire. When the flames died down, there was no trace of the fiendish duo. The manor, once a place of terror and despair, now stood silent and empty. Eliza returned to the village, the curse lifted, and the villagers were finally able to live their lives free from fear. The manor, though empty, stood as a reminder of the battle fought against the darkness, and as for Eliza, she became a legend, a symbol of hope, and a beacon of light in the face of darkness. Thus, the most devilish tale of the malevolent manor and its sinister occupants came to a victorious end, as the forces of good triumphed over the vilest of evils.